Are you wondering which assets need to be reported on the FAFSA? Hi, I'm Tina Steele, the FAFSA Guru, and today I want to talk to you about protected assets when completing this form. When you fill out a FAFSA form, you are not required to report any money you have in any retirement accounts or the equity that you have in the primary home that you live in. Those are two assets that are not reported and are actually protected on the FAFSA. So oftentimes I talk with families and parents that might have money setting in their bank account and it's earmarked for retirement or something like that. You're much better off putting that into an actual retirement account or paying down your home if you want to protect that asset on your FAFSA. I hope that helps.